the key knight among you will see this mech and ask themselves, does TTP really hate himself that much? Oh yeah. Hi friends, I'm TTP. Welcome back to German Mech Engineering. Today's mech is the Zeus 9S, a mech that is notoriously hard to play due to its weird hardpoint locations and kind of flimsy nature. So this one is gonna be a challenge. Let's go. What am I stuck on now? Okay. Yeah, it's not good. Target spotted. Mm, let's follow up a little bit closer. Just center. Two minutes into the match, some of our assaults have not even arrived yet. <laughs> I'm not talking about the snipers. I'm talking about the other guys that just joined us. Okay, got blue lasers up top there. Means any cover. See me from here? The, the sec. New target the second I look away, this guy comes around the corner. You're gonna be fucking kidding me, dude. No opposition. Like, what? What is it with these people and their sixth sense? Huh? That's a side torso. Need assistance. Target spotted. Target spotted. New target, target acquired. Spotted. Two low mounts couldn't hit him. Exhibit A. Target spotted. New target acquired. Target spotted. Can't look anywhere without being sniped at by these three dudes up top here. New target acquired. Meanwhile, all the enemies are over there as well. So, yeah. Target spotted. Target spotted. New target acquired. Level critical. Maybe I can help him over here. I just hit an IT cheetah with two binary laser cannons and four ear mediums, and he just doesn't care. New target acquired. UAV 
activated. New target, target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. Center torso critical damage. Torso critical damage. Left arm destroyed. Medium laser destroyed. Right torso critical damage. Heat sink destroyed. This this time the sniper actually shoot uh, shot something. That's good. Seventy five percent, eighty nine percent. Okay. Target acquired. Oh, that's a blackjack. I'm gonna get my nose down here. Because I'm just gonna die otherwise. And now we wait. I wonder if there's a better spot for me to go to. Okay. Target acquired. Target spotted. New target Another acquired. Another both of you. One touch CT on the Yakishida. I'm coming, Rosalie! Target spotted. Oh, this guy's almost dead as well. Target destroyed. Rip. Finally, I got the cheetah. Hey. Light mix. Very flimsy. Just eats a full salvo, doesn't care. <laughs> Guys, we survived. All this fighting for 800 damage on the solo kill. Plus two killing blows and two KVDs. Pokemon's destroyed two AV detections. Oh, it looks like we have a couple of dudes up top now, though. That's good. Target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. Four on top side, three line, two left, two right. Lies. Dirty lies. Six forty two is the range on these, okay. Eyes up for Target spotted. Rough neck plus. Mm-hmm. You have set lock. Target spotted. Target spotted. Target spotted. Keep an eye out for the alarm lords. Battle master, two rifles. Need assistance. Delta three, beacon. Target spotted. No, he isn't hurt. Target spotted. Mhm. Mm I'm coming for your Target toes. Spotted. Heat level critical. Target spotted. My armor's almost gone already. It's almost like that 70 armor on that Zeus is paper thin. Target spotted. 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 New 
target acquired. Target spotted. Oh, I could see it, but I couldn't shoot it. No. Target spotted. It's a good UAV. Target spotted. Oh, I coming down that ramp. Target spotted. UAV activated. New target acquired. Target spotted. Target spotted. Wow. Warning incoming missile. Target spotted. Warning incoming missile. That's bad. Gonna try and push over here. But I'm too slow, I feel. New target acquired. Oh shit. Heat level critical. Heat level critical. Override shutdown. Mm -hmm. Only TTB kills TTB. <laughs> wow. Oh, the guys just folded. Target up. Oh, it just did some okay damage though. Destroyed. I like that boy you built. Looks solid. Even good evening. How's it going? Starting to get a little bit better, but I think it's too little too late. Oh, we still have a shadow cat. Oh, this could take a while. New target acquired. Or not. Right flag yeah, no, it doesn't take a while. Right torso. <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't take a while. He's dead. Solid, solid Zeus run, I would say. One KMDD, almost 800 damage done, 700 tanked, and four components. Yeah, not bad. Well, I would say those were two solid matches. Here is the build on screen, guys. We're using a light engine 300, MRM 30 in the right arm, double binaries in the left torso, triple ear mediums in the left arm, and an ear medium laser in the CT slot. We've got two tons of ammo for the MRMs. We've got four double heat sinks plus the two internal ones in the engine. Endo steel structure, double heat sinks, and standard armor. Armor up front as much as possible. I have two back armor right here, but these days I would just put um, zero back armor and everything up front. The thing with the Zeus is that basically the armor equals a structure. So um, once you get through the armor, there's a lot of structure to work through, which is kind of nice. The Zeus itself is only an 80 tonner, and the biggest problem that the Zeus kind of has is its weird geometry. Everything is like low mounted, shooting from the hip, uh, the arms are set off quite wide, and uh, all in all together, the Zeus is a very, hmm, how should I put it, a very weird mech in the 80 ton assault department, and uh, you barely never see anybody play this mech because it's just not very good. But if you want to give yourself a challenge, and after the last couple of uh, rounds of crook adjustments, at least you will have a fighting chance, and this build wasn't too bad. With its 86 firepower, running very hot though, as you saw, 61 kph off speed, and in terms of crooks, we get 10% energy cooldown, 10% energy range, 15% missile cooldown, 10% missile spread, 40% extra velocity on the MRMs right here, and 10% heat, plus a whopping structure throughout the mech, 
as well as 25% less chance of receiving a critical hit. So as far as the quirks are concerned, you would say, hey, these are fairly good quirks, but yeah, they have to be because the mech otherwise, in terms of its geometry, is just hot garbage. So yeah, that has to be said, guys. I don't want to sugarcoat this. Playing a Zeus in this game is not easy. Of course, there are better builds for this mech. For example, there is a blue laser build on the Zeus that is not bad at all. But um, yeah, Zeus in general, something for people that want to see if they can challenge themselves a little bit. So if this build is interesting to you, I would recommend you try it out um, and see if you can make it work. And hopefully you will have some fun with it. Make sure that, of course, you use the skill tree that I'm proposing. Um, between when I recorded these videos and between now, there's a couple of months time passed where I got into comp play. So I would probably play the mech a little bit differently these days. Maybe have a different skill tree than I used back then or whatnot. So keep that in mind. That could get us a little bit of extra performance. Uh, but with a mech like that, also always, always look for your positioning. Look at where your teammates are. Look at where the enemies are. Position yourself accordingly, if possible. You have 61 kph. You're not super slow, but you're also you're still quite slow. So you need to be planning ahead where you're going and uh, putting that into the equation as well. It's going to be a challenge. I hope you guys will go ahead and take the challenge. If you already have the mech and you've never used it before, then maybe you will have a new idea on how to build this mech. Now, try it out. Let me know how it goes for you. The Zeus is loose and good luck with that one. At this point, of course, I would like to say thank you so much. To all my amazing supporters. Guys, I literally couldn't do this without you. But if you weren't there on a supporter yet and would like to say thanks for the videos, then please have a look at the video description. You will find links to my Patreon, my merch store, all the hardware that I'm currently using that you can get on Amazon, or of course you can become a channel member or set this up with thanks right here on YouTube. Thank you.